A local high school softball team is on a 22 game winning streak. McMichael is also ranked number one in the state. The team is full of experience with eight seniors on the 15 player roster. Photojournalist Brian Hall met up with the young women hoping to bring home a state title. We don't let our record get to us. We're excited that we are undefeated so far, um, but we know we always need to show up to play. No, you have no idea what another team can show up and they may play better than us, but we do our best. The key is the word team. Um, we don't count on one or two players. Uh, we can hurt you all the way through the lineup, and I've been saying that all along. And you know, even if the ones in the middle aren't aren't doing it that game, somebody's going to pick us up. Well, with eight seniors this year, we've all grown up together and played really well. Um, I take pride in this team because I just know that we can succeed no matter what comes our way. Um, I know that if we get in the hole, we can come into the playoffs soon, and I know if we get in the hole that we'll be able to succeed. These kids are friends on and off the field. They've been playing together forever, and uh, you know, it, it makes it special. It, it builds a bond and makes you a stronger team in general. It's becoming really hard on me getting to the end of uh, this run with this seniors because uh, I've known them their whole lives. And, but it makes everything a little bit sweeter and you go through everything together. No, I, I'm, I'm not worried about them being too overconfident. They are having fun. And, and I've always preached to them that if you hustle and, and you have fun, the rest of the game takes care of itself. They all love the game. Um, they do their all, I do my all, and we're a good team together. We know where we're at right now, um, and we know we still have stuff to work on, um, but we can only go up from here. Great job, ladies. McMichael will take the field again this week in the conference tournament action. Their quest for a state softball championship begins when the playoffs get underway next Tuesday. 22 game winning streak. That's crazy. That's that is amazing. And props to the sports department for doing this story because I, I feel that softball is often overshadowed mm -hmm. by baseball. And so this is a really great opportunity to highlight um, a, a team that's doing really, really well. Absolutely. And, I mean, that's. That's no joke. I mean, 22 and 0. I don't care what sport it is, mm -hmm. what level you're on. The odds of you winning mm -hmm. all those games. Plus, now it's hard for them to mentally go, "Okay, that's over." Now the playoffs, it's mm -hmm. one game at a time, you know, so good for them. We report on a lot of teams that do pretty well, whether it be baseball, softball, basketball, but for these ladies to have such a close bond, as the coach was saying, a lot of them have known each other since they were young. It just goes to show how that bond really has an impact on the performance as well in the game. It does. If you know each other and how they play, how you play, mm -hmm. you get a leg up on other people. And if you're a softball player coming up, you see this happening. Yes. Yes, you want right. to play for them. I was going to say the same thing because they have eight seniors on that roster, so they could be up Lots next. Lots of room. Yeah. God, you got, you got cap space now. Yeah, you got to get right. some more people in there.